All right, guys, welcome back to another Fortnite video. Hit that like button down below if you like getting free items and skins and stuff in Fortnite, because that is what we're going to be talking about today. We have got a bunch of free things to go over, two new free Deadpool styles. That's right, guys, even more fun Deadpool stuff. On top of that, we're going to be able to get a free back bling spray and things like that. That's a lot of fun. And also, there's just a bunch of other leaks to talk about in general with today's brand new update. And I'm going to be trying to cover as much as I can of it in today's video. So if you find it helpful, if you enjoy it, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and turn on notifications for more videos like this coming out in the near future. And on top of that, if you want to help support me, be sure to use code the Lamaser in the item shop as an epic partner. It helps support the channel and I appreciate it a ton. But without further ado here, guys, let's go ahead and jump on into it. Now, real quick, before we get into like the free items and stuff, one thing that's very interesting that was added in this update is um, dual pistols. Or sorry, I shouldn't say dual pistols they're dual silenced pistols which is very interesting considering that we just got the dual deadpools hand cannons and also i will say that these don't look anything too special but i would assume that they're likely a new item that is either you know coming into the game soon or maybe it's already in the game i'm recording this before downtime has even ended so keep an eye out for it maybe it's in the game but honestly my guess would be a brand new item there were some ideas floating around that maybe it's for spy games or something like that that's possible but at the same time i mean that would be very disappointing so hopefully not <laughs> but i guess it's possible either way though pretty cool and then after that guys let's go ahead and jump into it with some free items and things because of course talking about free items and stuff is very very fun so first of all before we get into the deadpool stuff we have got some rewards um surrounding fncs or in other words the fortnite championship series so yeah we're going to be able to get three total rewards from this event and basically the first reward going from the least interesting to the most interesting is simply an emote with the FNCS symbol. Again, not very interesting right there. I mean, do people even really use emoticons, whatever they're called? So yeah, nothing too crazy. Then after that, we get a spray. So a little bit more interesting. Still nothing overly fun or overly crazy. You guys know how it is with these types of rewards. And then finally, we do get a pretty interesting item, which is this back bling right here. Now, this appears to just be a style for the skateboard back bling. I forget the exact name of it, but it's pretty cool overall. It looks like it's a reflective gold, which fits in with the season very well. That would go really nice with um, Shadow Midas. Could you imagine that? Could be a cool combo. But yeah, those are the three items that we'll be able to get for this. Now, as for how to specifically go about getting them, apparently they will be given out for free as rewards when you watch the FNCS finals on Twitch. And the FNCS finals are going to be streamed from April 17th to 19th, which is coming up soon. So if you do want a chance at getting those items, those are the best basics of it. I believe you have to link your Fortnite account to Twitch, but they'll likely update us on that with an official news article explaining more about the specific process of how to get the accounts linked and get those rewards. But let's go ahead and get into it, guys, with some really interesting leaked stuff that has to do with Deadpool, has to do with Marvel, and also free items and things. You guys know I love showing you more free items and stuff. But first of all, let's talk about the leaks around X-Force because this leads directly into the Deadpool stuff, but it is very, very interesting overall. So basically, some of the leaked skins that we just got in today's update are from a set called X-Force and also in the Marvel series. So same exact series as Deadpool and the Avengers because obviously they're Marvel, but the X-Force is not so well known. And like, for example, here just went over the Cable character guy. I'm not exactly sure how to explain it, but his description says seasoned soldier and master battle strategist. But again, what is X-Force? Well, according to Wikipedia, it is a fictional team of superheroes appearing in American comic books published by Marvel Comics, most commonly in association with X-Men. So yeah, again, I'm not much of an expert on this particular set of superheroes or whatever you want to call them, but that's where they're from because on top of that, we also get the character Domino from this series too. A very interesting skin overall. The description for it says, make your own luck. Honestly, it's a really cool skin. I could see a lot of people using this, but there's also Psylocke, which is a very, very very cool skin because she's like a ninja. I'm assuming she's a ninja in the series. Again, I don't really know, but her description is telekinetically enhanced master martial artist. And then of course, you've got some back blings as well. Like her back bling is very, very cool. It's a katana. I like that one a lot. And then uh, cable cloak is obviously the one for cable. We haven't had a cape in like a long time, so that's nice. And then the domino pack, as you can see right there, is another pretty cool one. Oh, and there's also going to be a bundle that you can get these in. So more than likely, probably going 
going to be in the item shop. And then also these are the pickaxes for them. I'm not really sure what the pink one is. Honestly, that's a bit confusing. But yeah, it's really cool, right? Is that a pickaxe or is it a back bling? I'm not really sure. But yeah, guys, let's go ahead and jump into it with the brand new variant or style of Deadpool that we're going to be able to unlock for free very, very soon. So basically, guys, this is the week nine challenges for Deadpool and it will get us the X-Force Deadpool style as you can see right here. So yeah, it is a very interesting style that is basically a light gray slash white with the black accents and then Deadpool himself has the red eyes. Now again, I'm not too familiar with X-Force. I know there was like a reference to it in Deadpool 2, but I don't think this color scheme was ever in it, right? But it is an official color scheme, so I'm not exactly sure where it comes from. Probably one of the comic books, but again, I'm not an expert on it. Either way though, it is very cool and I'm excited to unlock it. But again, this is for the week 9 challenges and don't worry, I'll have a week 9 challenge guide for you specifically, but we do know that it is going to be coming out in week 9 and specifically the two challenges are find Deadpool shorts. So we'll be going over the locations of that in my week 9 challenge guide. And also you've got the challenge salute Deadpool's pants and then you'll be able to earn the Deadpool X-Force variant style. Just again, overall it's very cool. I like the colors of it and it's just awesome to keep on getting free stuff. And speaking of which, I'm pretty sure we're going to have week 10 challenges as well because there's also an unmasked version of the X-Force Deadpool as I'm pretty sure another style. So that would make sense because obviously we got the unmasked version of the regular Deadpool variant as a challenge for the recent week 8 challenges. So it would make sense that week 10 we're going to be getting the unmasked version and then week 9 is just the regular X-Force style. But again, I'll keep you in the know with that. So week 10 challenge guide will come out in a little over a week when those challenges go live. So be sure to stay tuned for that. But keeping it going here, guys, we have got some more leaked things to cover, and this one is very interesting. It's a brand new LTM, but it is going to be a very fun LTM. Let me say that right now. Basically, it is called Arsenic, and thanks to Fort Tory on Twitter for uh, finding a bunch of these details. But yeah, the name of it is Arsenic, and it looks to be like an infected type game mode, if that makes sense. Infection LTM, if you remember like Halo, that's what I think of when I think of Infection. If you ever played that, it was also in Call of Duty, but basically there's two teams. One is the Infection or basically the zombies and the other is the survivors and randomly it picks like a few zombies and then the rest of the people are survivors and these zombies can only really use melee or something like that and they try to chase down these survivors they essentially have unlimited lives so they can keep respawning but yeah they try to chase down the survivors and as soon as they like melee them or in this case I would assume that it has something to do with pickaxing them the survivor would then move over to the infected team so the infected team slowly grows until no more of the humans are left or if the survivors last the entire time of the well time of the round it's a very fun mode and then here in Fortnite, apparently there's going to be like power-ups and stuff like block jump block actions one is like double jump one is growl which i'm not exactly sure what that means but yeah that is definitely quite intriguing and then also there were some strings that were found such as you've become infected get out there and take care of those pesky humans Again, supporting the idea that it's going to be survivors versus like zombies. Also, there's one that says just one human remains, team up and take them down. Again, implying that it's going to be just like those infection game modes from Halo and Call of Duty. And then finally, you're human. If you want to stay that way, gear up, team up and survive against the infected. So I'm so excited for this. It sounds like it really is going to be a lot of fun. And speaking that it's like a very special LTM, it's entirely possible that it could come with a special event like with challenges and things like that they were talking about in the past I remember an epic games employee said that they plan on adding a lot more challenges to help us get to those golden variants of the skins and I mean this is the perfect opportunity to add some really fun challenges really unique challenges and you guys know I'll help you out with that hit that subscribe button again if you haven't yet I'll be helping you out with those challenges with my usual guides showing you the easiest ways to get those done but on top of that maybe there's uh, some special skins that will come with it. The only thing is that we haven't really seen any free items related to this game mode quite yet. It's entirely possible that they could be added in next week's update, or maybe they're going to save this for two weeks and we'll see this um, in the update again two weeks from now. They did delay the season, so there's definitely a lot of time to do.
do things like this. Either way though, sounds like a ton of fun. But anyways guys, that is going to be it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and if you did, remember to hit that subscribe button down below and turn on notifications for more fun videos like this coming up in the near future. On top of that, be sure to check out some of my previous videos such as explaining the Doomsday event. Definitely check that one out. That stuff's coming soon so you want to know about that. But again guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video and I will see you in the next one.